So it happened again. I am really kind of upset. Uh, this is the second time uh, the footage that I took from my camera uh, did not transfer over or somehow was corrupted. Um, so anyways, um, I'm giving you kind of a, the short version of the back squats that I did for my Instagram channel because I was just recording on my uh, iPhone. So yeah, um, I was working on a 54321, which is a build to a heavy five, and then a heavy four, three, two, one. So as you can tell, I made it all the way up to a 305, one rep. Um, and the rest of my footage was fine, um, but just that initial set of workout I did for some reason was not working. I'm not sure why, it's really annoying the heck out of me. However, I get a new camera today. So it is in the mail and almost here. And I am super excited about it and should make a lot of my videos a lot better quality, a lot clearer and um, yeah, so I am looking forward to that. But anyways, I want to just talk about camera gear and tech stuff the whole time. Um, so this workout was a, definitely a, a different take off of the strength day workouts that I've been doing. Uh, still did my back squats, still did push presses, but as you can tell, I'm at 185. I'm actually doing regular push presses. I'm not just doing the strict presses. So, anyways, I uh, was really happy with my uh, strict press at 145. One rep, I think that's probably a max. A new PR for me. I need to check. Um, and then, this is a completely different uh, workout that he's having me do. Um, it's a 21-15-9 of knee to chest um, and uh, dumbbell push presses. So I think it's a, this is a good one for working on core as also working on your grip strength because you're basically holding on to that bar and your body's getting heavier and heavier it feels like. Um, so. Anyway, so that is the second part of the work, or third part of the workout for today. Uh, really happy with it. I think it's a uh, great, great change of pace. I like when I'm able to do new workouts. Um, that's kind of the one thing I miss about doing normal uh, CrossFit classes is that uh, it's always kind of changing up and you never really know. Um, you might know the night before what your workout will be. Um, doing the programming, I'm definitely getting stronger and definitely seeing very tangible results and I'm very happy for that. Um, however, the one thing I do miss is with, uh, um, with regular CrossFit workouts, you know, it, it changes every day. Um, one day you'll be doing push presses, one day you'll be doing deadlifts, another day you'll be just doing box jumps or rows or kettlebell swings or whatever. And I kind of like that. I like the variety. Uh, I like being able to kind of change up a few things. And uh, I think it was nice. I was happy about this workout even though it wasn't super easy. It also wasn't difficult. Um, I feel the time that I did it in was a pretty decent time. And uh, so, yeah, I am uh, happy about it. So, the weather is very unpredictable right now. <laughs> we just, in the Northwest, we just broke our all time record for the amount of rain in the spring. We got like 44 inches of rain in the past like six seven weeks or something like that and it has just not stopped supposedly on some of the coast they got over 10 feet of rain it's just insane i don't know why it's been raining so much up here but yeah but i will once things start clearing up and being nicer um 
we'll start doing some running and getting some of that stuff in so do not fret i will be doing stuff differently soon and i'm kind of looking forward to that on my last set of push presses and I believe I did them all unbroken yep and that's the end of my workout for today so thank you guys so much for joining me and uh, please feel free to go check out some of my other videos if this is your first time over and uh, also make sure to hit that subscribe button that you see right above me and also check out some of my new episodes and also if you're still interested and not bored of me completely head over to Instagram and check out my channel there it's a lot of great stuff see you in the next video